everyone welcome back to my channel so today I have this very simple Valentine's Day design and it's very versatile you can use whatever colors you would like whatever glitters you would like you can do it shiny instead of matte but I just want to show you guys how simple it was essentially to do these hearts and very fast especially if you have clients who like to do holiday themed nails or if you yourself want to or your kids or whatever so these names are very cute madam glam sent me over these colors and they're kind of love theme and love with you and my heart goes boom and this one's unrelated this name is just color i already had and this one is hey honey so madam glam thought it would be cute kind of to do looks with gels that kind of have play on the holiday so these are glitters they don't have anything to do with the Valentine's name. Well, that one is called Love Potion, so I guess that, that's just a coincidence. This one's called Illumination. And all this stuff is from Madame Glam. Again, this is a video I've partnered up with Madame Glam to bring you guys. So I'm just dishing out the colors. And I'll be using the Wildflowers matte top coat with this design because I... I like that matte top coat. And I've used the poly gel from Madame Glam in Japanese Camellia. I might be saying that wrong. And I'll have a separate video on me doing the actual poly gel part. So look out for that. It'll be in the future. <laughs> so I'm just taking a dotting tool and this is so simple to do. Two dots, connect them and kind of fill it in to get that heart shape. Boom, that's it. Again. If you missed it, two dots, pull them down, boom, heart. How simple is that? Now you can do these in a more, like, like in a pattern, you know, like polka dots would be vertically down the center of the nail, haphazardly, kind of like I did in like an ombre type fashion. However you want to do it, you can do it, put a little polka dots in between, little swirls whatever you want to do but instead of trying to hand draw hearts like a little fine brush and trying to do this look how simple this is now what i didn't do and i didn't feel like i needed to you can take a brush and kind of pull that point of the heart to make it even more sharp but i didn't really feel like it needed because it was so small and it's i mean it, it pretty it pretty much looks like a good heart <laughs> but if you want to get a little more sleek you can so I went ahead and did all those designs. Again, you can do them whatever color you want. I cured it, and then I'm putting the matte top coat on, and I'm gonna go ahead and cure that. And if you wanna leave it shiny, feel free. Um, this is what, how it looks matte, and you can leave it like this as well. That's just absolutely fine. Or you can do it shiny, like I said, and again, feel free to use a different background color. It's just the dotting tool and doing the hearts like that. That's really one that, what I wanted to show you guys and this glitter part and just show off these colors. So I, after I've cured it, I'm going in, I'm tracing over these hearts just as simple with the dotting tool, dumping the glitter on there and curing it. So basically like a sugaring effect, essentially. And seeing how simple the hearts were to do with the dotting tool, it makes something like this super simple. And I thought it would be cute, the contrast of the matte with the just little hints of the glitter in there and then i'm doing this last one with the red and that's it dumping the glitter on there kind of tapping the excess off cured in the light for the recommended time 30 seconds uv i think two minutes i mean 30 seconds led two minutes uv and this is our final look how cute is that you guys so again do it how you feel, tweak it how you want, tag me in your pictures on Instagram. I'd love to look at them and see how you do it. Do it cuter, do it different, better colors. Don't forget to check out Madam Glam. I have 30% off with coupon code Tabitha. If you don't use my coupon code, I appreciate if you use the link at the very least. So go and leave comments below. Don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. Bye.